Hi, this is Lindsay, the LED lady. We're here in San Jose, California. I'm here at Paseo Villa, a multifamily complex dedicated to sustainability and energy efficiency. Here with me today is Kendra Pascal, Director of Business Development with Terralux. Thank you so much for being with us today. Thanks for having us, Lindsay. So I understand Terralux has a wonderful array of retrofit LED products for buildings like this. Can you tell us a little bit more? Definitely. Our D-Series retrofit allows for the replacement of any compact fluorescent pin CFL into a downlight situation. So LED technology lasts a long time. How long do your products last? Our products are engineered for reliability with a seven-year warranty. So that includes any type of installation for any runtime, even 24-7. Tell me a little bit more about the retrofit and will it void any UL certifications? All of our products have a UL certification for retrofit. So again, this allows us to go into an existing fixture without having to replace the entire fixture and maintain the original UL listing of that fixture. Kendra shared with me how Terralux retrofits save a lot of money versus installing brand new fixtures. She introduced Matt Sully with Terralux to show us how easy and quick it is to retrofit a CFL downlight here at Paseo Villas. So the first thing we're going to do is make sure the power is off, which we did, and we're going to remove the lamps. The next thing is a wing nut here uh, in the, holding the trim in the ceiling. What we're going to do is reuse the existing trim so that we don't have to damage this nice stucco ceiling. And it uh, speeds up the installation because there won't be any need to paint the area around the trim. Once you remove the trim, what you'll do is uh, disconnect the uh, three wires from the existing ballast. So what I'm gonna do is unclip the ballast here and then I have three uh, solid core wires that are plugged into the back of the existing ballast. Uh, using a slotted screwdriver, a very small one, I'm going to unclip these wires uh, from their poke-in connectors. Okay, all right. And uh, then I'm going to attach the Terralux driver right back in the exact same location. The wires will poke in to the back of the driver just like uh, they were attached to the ballast. And this will snap right back into the ballast location because it's the same size and mechanical configuration as the ballast. So I'm going to poke these in. Okay, there's black, there's white, and green. And I'm going to snap that securely back where the original ballast was. So what we'll do now is I'm going to slide the quick connector through the trim. And I'm going to take uh, the bracket assembly here, and this is going to reconnect on the inside. So the clip I've pushed through the center rod, and I'm now going to reinstall the wing nut that will hold uh, the whole assembly in place. So then we'll take the LED engine, and this will connect to the quick connector here that allow you to easily align these so they only go in one way. Click and snap, and it's connected and then we'll push this back up into the inside of the reflector. So now we've got the LED engine in place uh, and nice and secure inside the existing reflector. So Matt, I'm noticing that we're going into a hard ceiling. What if this was to be installed in a T-bar ceiling? You know, you'd be able to lift up one of the side tiles and really get in um, closely. We wanted to show this installation because this is the most extreme retrofit situation where you cannot get into the ceiling um, but this is one of the only products on the market that allows you to retrofit a downlight that's hard sealing in. In terms of the existing CFL infrastructure, like the pin base, do we just leave that in or can we take it out? It's in this retrofit, we've left the lamp holders and the existing ballast in the ceiling. Um, it's up to you as an installer and as a building what you'd like to do. You know, you can remove them and take them out, but you can also speed up installation by simply leaving them in the ceiling. They're no longer connected electrically and they're just kind of hanging out out of everyone's way, so it doesn't, it doesn't really matter. So the final step uh, is what we're gonna do is snap on this uh, diffuser. This will keep the LEDs from um, being too sharp or blinding, and this just snaps using these clips directly onto the engine that we just installed, and it creates a nice seamless finished look on the inside of the reflector trim. And that's all. We'll turn back on the power and we'll have long-lasting LED light. So Kendra, that was another wonderful retrofit done by Terralux. So where can we find these products? So Terralux products can be purchased nationwide through our agency lighting network. All of that information can be found on our website at terralux.com. And what about any rebates for people that are around the country? 
All of our products are Energy Star certified, so that means typically that they would qualify for any rebate available out there. It just depends on the specific rebates that are available in those territories. Uh, rebates can vary anywhere from $15 up to about $50, depending on the, the utility. So what we've got is a quick and easy installation, retrofitting so you don't have to buy brand new, and more energy efficiency. For buildings that are running 24-7, it seems like a great deal to me. It's an excellent solution. Thank you so much. This is Lindsay, the LED lady. We're here at Paseo Villa with another wonderful retrofit done by Terralux.